okay you guys the sun is brutal right now but i'm going to pick up my dad at the airport very soon and well very soon i mean like three and a half hours but since the mall is right near the airport i haven't been to this mall since well before i started collecting squishmallows they have a five below a box lunch a hot topic a claire's a burlington which i'm at right now like they have so many things they have like some other random toy stores that sell squish uh they have a lego store not that it matters but you know what i mean it's gonna be great and they also have a rainforest cafe so we can check there and yeah so let's go squish hunting and i'm in my cool spooky skull get up as you can see and i have my bag with my auto clip so hopefully we have some good luck and yeah i'm going into burlington first since i got a parking spot right there which is pretty cool all right, this is gonna be a long hunt, but let's do it. I'm really excited, and yeah, let's go. No, it's Christmas. This store is massive. That's where I entered. That's the mall, and let's check the toys. They also have a Marshalls in the mall, which is crazy. Okay, now I don't think Burlington has any squish out right now, but I'm checking just in case. I don't see anything. Of course, there's always one dirty squish left. Like, what is that? Okay, not much at Burlington, but let's check all the other stores. Why is this not my size? Do you think I could wear that? Oh my god. Honestly, it would be like a fitted tee for me, but $5 for a FNAF shirt? Um, yeah, I think I'll do it unless the line is crazy long. Okay, I'm gonna hide it like right here and get it on the way out because the line is massive. Five below in a mall? What? Alright, you guys, this is a first for me. FNAF? Okay, so here are a few of the squish items they had here. Not too many, it was kind of barren here. They had these cute 25 mini erasers pack, and they had the new Squishmallow sticker sets. Okay, so it's the day before the second Halloween pop this year, but they don't have any of the squish out, so I'm still gonna have to order them online, but oh well. All right, back into the mall. That's crazy. Box lunch. Okay, you guys, so I was lucky enough to see one of the new Squishmallow squads in person. So this is Bessie, and she is a blueberry bat. So stinking cute. And then here is also the new strawberry cat, Olina. They are missing, like, the monkey banana and everything. But I am really surprised that Bessie's left. She's so cute. I love her embroidering. And I don't know, I might get the 8-inch. I might. Also, look at my fit. I think I'm pretty cool. They also had some clips. They had some of the sea cows left. Pretty cool. I did already get all the sea cows, if you guys remember. And then I also saw one of the new Christmas Hello Kitty Squish. Looks like I missed out on that mushroom, my melody that I wanted, so that's very disappointing. However, I do want the squish. I will be waiting till after Halloween to buy Christmas, though. Oh, I didn't know they sold him here. I got him for like half that. Cute though. Poor guy is impaled though. I forgot they were selling this cute little guy at Hot Topic and stuff, but look, I also saw these Halloween like keychains for Sanrio and they match the cute Sanrio squish. Okay, now time to head into Hot Topic. Doesn't look like much at first. They have some of the old ones. They do have Alina back there. None of the other like Bessie or any of that squad. But, look, this is my first time seeing the Reshma backpack in person. So, stinking cute, I love her. Okay, now I have a decision to make. Should I buy her? I was not expecting to find her today. Ah, she's only $35, which I think is a decent price, so I'm thinking of her. And I found matching Reshma Squishmallow earrings. So, they have two types. They also have Archie the Axolotl. I love the Reshma ones though, definitely my favorite. Okay, I want a few things, but I'm gonna go to all the stores first and then wrap around back and get oh those gosh. things I want. I'm excited for the new Squishmallows ones, but right now they have the FNAF ones. I just need a big 12 inch Rezzel. That's what I'm looking for right now. Some of the new ones. This one new? Oh my gosh, it's like Mothman. No way, they have 5 inches. Oh my gosh, why are 5 inches $13? Oh my gosh. Oh my god, one of the tiny stacks! They're also 13 This one is so cute. One of my dreams of the new Squish. Oh my gosh. Should I do it? Should I do it? 
I don't know, I might get that backpack. I found Millie the monkey too. Makes me really want to get them both. They look so cute together, oh my gosh. But I can't just buy every squish I want, you know? This guy's hidden. I also want him, but I actually ordered him on Alan Goose, lol. But this one wasn't available. I think I'll wait on them for now. We'll see. I might get the backpack. Ooh, a little five inch Hello Kitty. Oh, they also have this one too. Cute, cute, cute. And then they have all of these blind bags. And they have this one. This one is the same price and it's like half the size of the other ones. I'm definitely gonna get the one at Hot Topic. Plus I can get hot cash. And I'll probably get the matching earrings to be fair. Oh, girl, girl. Where do, hello, where do I put her? Okay, tiny dilemma. Should I get Caldina or get the bigger Reshma? Would you get this one or the one at Hot Topic? They have all of them. Even bought Tamaru eating popcorn, are you kidding? And then look at this one. Oh my gosh, the last my melody. Not gonna get them though, they're so expensive. Next stop is Marshall's. Okay. Fake Squishmallow, yep. I don't think they have any squish right now. That's like the same one I have. The mine didn't come with candy or toys. All right, time to head back to Hot Topic and look what I found, oh my gosh, from Killer Clowns from Outer Space. But this guy was like so expensive, like no, sorry. Now I think I'm gonna get Reshma, I have decided. They have these earrings too, except Cameron is like missing, okay. But I'm so excited. These earrings are so cute and hopefully they make a bunch more. So I'm gonna get these ones to match the backpack. Also, I found a bunch of the brand new Series 11 Squishville capsules and Alexi is supposed to be here. So now begins the big hunt where I'm sticking my camera into the hole, that's what she said, and trying to see if I can significantly see if Alexi is in any of these capsules. So here is who you could get. I also kind of want Abe the Bearded Dragon, but it's totally fine. I'm super excited to just get Alexi today. These last few capsules are the ones I think could be lucky, and I think this one is definitely Alexi. I can see his coloring. So I'm gonna grab what I'm getting, as well as some stickers, and make my purchase. I'm so happy. You guys, this mall has a human claw machine. I totally would have done it, but they did not have any squish. However, I did see this little claw machine that did have squish, but like super old squats. Here we are. The best one in my opinion. This is the one I would go to as a kid all the time. And look how big the gift shop is. And look how many squish they have. None I really want, but very cute though. I mean, I do want that. Also, I'm eating a lollipop from Five Low. But I would want her. The flips into her, but not right now. After that big purchase, I spent $65. I've never seen this one so big though. Honestly, I still really, really want this guy. He's so cute. The little breakfast sandwich. Oh my gosh. I also made a quick trip into the Deso. Our next stop is Chrono Toys and it seems promising from the Halloween Squish and look it. Look at you guys. Oh my gosh. Hug me Connor. He's so cute. You have three. I can't believe it. I can't believe it. Oh my gosh. Have to get him. I have him in the bigger size. Wilfred, I already have. I was not expecting to find so many squish here, especially these hug me's. Oh my gosh. Look at the five inches too. Oh my gosh, I want him. He doesn't have a tag. What? Oh, her. Him. 
All right, these are ten dollars. Why would he be fifty dollars? Are you kidding? I guess I won't get him because that's insane. <laughs> this one though. Well, I'm disappointed about Connor, but I'm really excited that I found my dream little monster 5-inch. Okay, so the rest of Connor's squad is $10, but Wilfred is 30 like, okay, and Connor's 50 I'm sorry, I'm still just, like, shocked by this. I guess I won't. He's way too expensive. He's so cute. Why is he $50? 50 I could probably get him cheaper online for that. Nope. Getting this guy, though not getting the freaking overpriced they should be ten dollars like are you kidding even wilfred like wow nope no thanks so heartbreaking but they are both so cute together you guys sadly i can't get the other version of the connor hug me to match the bigger size i have but oh well and it looks like they also have some of the new christmas sanrio squish I do want Shadow. Okay, so I've been Deso Shadow since the release, and I've never found him in person before today, so that is really exciting. However, even this guy is upcharged a little bit, so I will wait on him. They do have some clips as well. These ones aren't really too overpriced or anything. Pretty decent normal prices, but none that I really want. Yay! Shall I check Dave and Buster's if they have Squish? Pretty loud. Back at Burlington. Not getting the FNAF shirt, that line is not worth it. Okay you guys, sorry for the weird angle and lighting, but I'm back in my car. Let's do a quick haul. So, I thought I was gonna get that cute Hug Me Connor, the smaller one than the one I found. $50, are you kidding me? If he was $10 or 20, 25 maybe, 50, are you kidding? No. But I did get this guy, he was only $10. I did want him, he was sold out on Alan Goose. However, he does not have a tag, so kind of a bummer, but pretty cute. Five below. I just got some candy, stickers, sticky notes, whatnot. I did not get the Squishmallow eraser, but I did want them. Then I did get the beautiful Strawberry Reshma backpack. She is massive. Gosh, like I was his bright sun. She is massive compared to the one at Claire's, as you can see. Twice the size and the same price. And I don't have this squish in any form yet, so. I then found a Lexi squad, and I'm really excited, so should we open it right now? I think this is a Lexi, so hopefully it's him. And because of that, since you're getting hot cash, I also decided to get the matching strawberry cow earrings. And then I got like an Emily sticker and then some other non-squish related things. So you guys, I think I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna open it. Oh my gosh. Again, sorry for the horrible lighting and the bad audio, but I'm in the parking lot right now of the mall, so... But here we go, you guys. I hope, I hope, I hope. I think it will be him, so... Let's see, you guys. Three, two, one. This is the new series. <gasps> it is Alexi! I knew it! You guys, I knew it! I knew it! Oh my god, it's Alexi! Oh my gosh, you guys. Definitely worth it, definitely worth it. So, that is my haul. I got this little cow. This big cow, my first squish backpack. And then I, of course, got the no-name monster guy. Could have gotten the Connor Hockney, but he was crazy expensive, you guys. Also, that blueberry bat I wanted. I'm glad I passed up on that because then I got these guys, so. Plus, I ordered that blueberry bat on Alan Goose, so. Just saying. Anyways, that was pretty successful. Now we're going to go to one more store, not at the mall, and see what we can find. And here is Alexi. Oh my gosh. I missed out on Nightingale, and I really regret it, but now I have Alexi. That is so cute. I could tell, I could tell that I had spots when I looked on it from my phone. So that is so cute. She's so cute. And he, or he actually, and there he is. Oh my God, so adorable. He looks pink, but he is purple. All right, so I drove to another five below and then a Target is close by. So, and then I have to go pick up my dad from the airport and then we might check like food for less. All right, here we go. Lots of wine bags, but not the new uh, Squishum series. They do have this, I'm still looking for this one and the deer, honestly. Shopping spree today, for sure. Now off to Target. All right, one of our last stops is Target. You know I already got that. Look what I found, every different one. I haven't seen these out before. 
Like, that's so cool. This one's obviously my favorite. I've never been to this target before, so I have no idea where I'm going, but I got some phone help and stuff. All right. Anything special? Oh. Oh, they have a flip of them in the small size? Oh, gosh. I'm getting too much squish, you guys. Oh, and they have this flip, but I already got the runny milk flip. I already got them. Oh my gosh, I think I have to. Ugh. You're so cute. They flip from Kaden to Kadia. Or from Kadia to Kaden. Massive Pokemon. Hold on. Look at him. This guy's probably like 50 bucks. Holy crap. He's massive. <laughs> That's what she said. He's so cute. I don't know why, but he looks so much cuter in this humongous size. But no. Um... I don't know. I don't know how much they are. Crazy. <laughs> no, I keep finding my dreams because I want Shadow. Oh, I don't know. Should I get him? Should I get him? $15, $10 cheaper here than at that one store in the mall. Maybe. I might regret this, but I'm going to wait on Shadow. Even though I was just complaining about never finding him. And here he is. Ugh, he's so cute though. Okay, I am gonna get those things and this flip, though. Here he is! Look how stacked they are. That is crazy. I love my clip, though. It's definitely worth it, I think. Alright, let's check out. I need to, let's do a little spin. I need to go lead and pick up my dad. They did not let me buy it. They did not let me buy that Squishmallow. They said it was, like, salvage, and I was like, what does that mean? She's like, oh, we can't sell it. I was like, but what does that mean? She's like, oh, he's going to put it in a box. But I'm like, but what are you going to do with the box? Like, why do they're just going to throw them away in a box? Like, I don't get it. Why can't I buy it? Now I regret not getting Shadow since, well, I didn't want to buy another Squish today. Like two at once, but now I should have gone Shadow. Anyways, I can't do anything about it. So I have to go and leave here. After picking up my dad, I grabbed some dinner and then we went over to Ralph's, which was pretty close by. And this is the first time seeing a new squad. Oh my gosh, it's Orland's squad. No, I missed Mr. Orland. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I already got the Slytherin yeah. and actually I got all of them actually. All of them, yeah. yeah. Is that Slytherin? Lol, yeah it is. My dad is enjoying squish hunting with me, but this is exciting, but also sad. This is so sad. He is so cute. I've never seen Ernest in this big of a size before. My dad is mentioning stuff about the eyebrow, but he is adorable, honestly, but I'm so sad that I missed Mr. Orlin. I don't even see Callum anywhere either, though. I did end up digging in this massive box, and I found one Callum. There he is. Cute. Yeah. They don't have Mr. Orlin. How disappointing. How disappointing. Our last stop tonight before driving home is Food for Less, and they don't have Mr. Orlin. No! How disappointing. They really don't have many Halloween squish left either. Mostly just the tree pail, sadly. And that wraps up the squish hunt. Okay, you guys, so we're back from that huge squish hunt. It didn't seem that long, like, lengthwise in the video but it took up that entire three and a half hour chunk. And also after I got him, he and I squish hunted at a couple of places before coming home. But I know it's not as spooky and Halloween-y as all my other Halloween squish hunts, but I did get one of my Halloween dreams and we did see a bunch of Halloween squish as well. So I'm still classifying it as a Halloween squish hunt. And we got this beautiful cow and I do not have her in any squish form and I don't have a squishmallow backpack so I'm really excited that I got her plus I opened up Alexi I got that five inch etc so let's hop right in for the haul and review you guys because I got a whole bunch of things and yeah I was very excited I saw a lot of squish I wanted but I passed up on like that crazy expensive $50 Connor hug me anyways let's stop talking and get into the haul and review First things first, before the haul, I have to show my beautiful Halloween spooky kitty, shouldn't I? Mm, kitty? You're silly. You're so silly. Okay, everyone, so here is my haul. Looks mostly not Halloween, but it is Halloween, you guys. Don't be fooled by this massive pink squish. I went in there looking for mostly Halloween, 
did not expect getting this cutie nor the earrings i didn't know these even existed honestly so that was exciting to find and the sticker anyways let's hop right in i'm super excited okay let's do smallest to biggest First, I got this cute little Emily the Bat sticker. I only got stickers and pins because I wanted to get two hot cash because it was not going to be exactly $60. But she is very cute and I was happy to find her. And then I got these adorable Rashma the Strawberry Cow earrings. It literally matches the cutie that I got today. And these were $9.90. These were pretty decently priced. They are plastic, but still really nice quality, I think. And they're really cute and iridescent. They also had the axolotl ones as well. So very excited to get those. Then of course I opened up the brand new Series 11 Squishable Blind Capsule Alexi. Oh my gosh, did not know these capsules were going to be out so soon. They have released so many Squishable Blind Capsule series this year. Like, I think it's crazy, but I don't mind. I don't mind. I did miss out on Nightingale in like Series 8 or whatever it was and I really regret it so I was like I'm gonna try to get Alexi and I found him he is so cute he comes with this weird like dress or whatever it is but look how cute he is oh my gosh and he has his golden little horns and of course his tail if you guys saw my trick it was kind of pretty easy to see him in there like I totally saw the black spots and even a little bit of his golden horn so shouldn't be too hard to find him and yeah he is so cute especially his tiny little tail i love him so much and he's definitely worth the like ten dollars i think it was per blind capsule next up i found charlon i believe or charlon something like that they do not have their tag they were the last five inch sadly and i couldn't take the tag off the other one because it would be a different price also a different tag size and i didn't feel like taking the tag i don't know why the tag was gone none the matter there will be no bios in this video because the backpack doesn't have a bio but oh well charlon is so cute and he was my dream also he sold out pretty quickly on alangoose.com and he's only at stores like hallmark learning express Alan Goose. also i guess this chrono toy store right but i was really excited to find the last five inch i also really wanted the little cauldron but I paced myself, you guys. I kind of have to, especially during Halloween season. But Charlon is really cute. And look how big his little teeth are. Oh my gosh. I actually love his color design. Super cute. I love him so much. And it was a nice surprise to find him there. And yeah, I wish I had gone sooner to see what other squish they had for Halloween season. But oh well. And that is Charlon. And again, too bad. There's no bio for him. But you know what? It's okay. He is still really cute and I was really shocked to find him and he was only $10, which considering the price of that freaking Connor hug me, I was surprised he was only $10. So very, very cute. So happy to have him. And now the grand finale is this massive Reshma strawberry cow backpack. Like I said, I actually don't own either the first or the newer version of the strawberry cow. And cause I was just never able to find her and order her online without having to wait months for like pre-order and stuff but she is so cute look at the strawberry embroidered so adorable i love the yellow horns i mean her colors are adorable and she is my first squishmallow backpack now i wanted one this size the size of like the typical ones like the drew the dragon one that i have been deso for like years honestly but there was also caldina as you guys saw the other strawberry cow at claire's same price half the size and I know some people might want the smaller ones, but I think for like traveling and stuff, this is a good size, mostly because the little one barely fits anything. I should have taken some video. However, this one can fit a lot. So it's pretty decent size. Could probably shove like a few eight inches in there and she will look plump, but cute. And I really love her. I think she's definitely worth the $35. Plus I got two hot cash from how much I spent at Hot Topic to spend next month you guys and yeah 35 not too bad and look at the back there's the heart detail like on the original squish and even the tail even the tail like that's actually really cool i did not expect it to have the tail that's really awesome and here are the straps they are adjustable i think it's so amazing now no bio tag i think that would have been really cute if they would have added a little regular squish tag but you know it's okay it's okay I think they're adorable. They even have a gold zipper that has a Squishmallow logo on it. The details are amazing. The embroidery, everything is great. Totally worth the $35, I think, you guys. So it was a tough decision for me, 
but I think I made the right decision. She is so cute. Yay! My first squish backpack. I'm so happy. Okay, you guys, so that was the haul and review, and I hope you guys enjoyed this squish hunt. And that mall is amazing. Hopefully, I can do another squish hunt there soon. Okay, you guys, so that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this kind of less Halloween-y but still Halloween-y squish hunt. And I'm pretty excited with my new backpack as well as the little five inch monster. Very cute. Also Alexi, of course. But don't forget to leave a like and comment down below. Would you guys have gotten this backpack or the smaller Caldina backpack at Claire's? I do like that one, but I wanted the bigger one. Also, don't forget to subscribe because I'm still keeping all of the Halloween videos coming until after Halloween. I will probably still post a couple after Halloween as well, but I still have a lot of content for you guys, so make sure to stay tuned, and we'll see you in the next video. Bye!